the other section that has had some improvements is the theme section and what they've done they've added bigger size images for the theme so what we'll do I'll go over into that now if we go over to appearance and just cut across to themes here and select that you'll notice there's a much nicer layout here and I'll just pop back to the older version and click appearance and themes and you'll see instantly what I mean okay these are much smaller little thumbnails compared to these nice big looking thumbnails here and you'll notice when you roll over them you know you get this option to like click it and activate it get theme details so for example if I want to get some details of the new 2014 theme I click on that like that and it automatically pops up in this nice little little window here and it's got a nice description here and it gives me the option to activate down the bottom or I can I can choose a live preview if I like and if I want to scroll over to the next theme to take a look uh, how I would do that is quite simply see the button up here we've got uh, sorry the arrow buttons uh, quite simply click that and it'll scroll across to the next to the next theme and you can simply close the window just over here in the top right hand corner you'll see this little X and you can close out of that there so I really like that design I think it's a fantastic um, addition to this new version that's for sure and talking about themes the new 2014 theme great one actually it's one of my favorites now uh, I always like the 20 uh, the 2012 uh, 12 theme I thought that was great a great theme wasn't really impressed with the 2013 didn't do a lot for me but this particular 2014 theme is a really really good theme it's based on an existing theme actually um, uh, I can't remember the name of it off the top of my head in uh, one of the one of the premium themes I believe in the WordPress theme um, when you say you know you go to the WordPress themes you can get download the themes themes from the WordPress repository is the word I'm looking for uh, what they've done is they've done a few tweaks to it and they've added it to this new version of WordPress and called it 2014 uh, I've got a live preview of that over here I'm just going to show you that now and if you want to check this demo out yourself too all I've done is gone to if you have a look at my URL up here it's the 2014 demo dot wordpress dot com and you can go there and have a look at how this fully functions uh, I think it's a great theme this can be set this particular part of the theme here can be set as a grid or you can um, set it to a slider an image slider and that's all built into this theme so that's great because you don't need to go and get plugins and add that in to make that functionality work so I really do like this um, so go and check it out it's a beautifully designed theme I think really stylish love I just love the way this is laid out if I was starting a word if I was starting my WordPress site uh, or blog today I would definitely use this existing theme because you wouldn't have to do a lot of customization to it using a child theme at all uh, it is just out of the box it's a it's a beautiful it's a beautifully designed theme so I'm pretty impressed with it and uh, I think you know I think if you're starting a blog for the first time or you haven't really figured out where you want to go with your blog um, this is a great great theme to start out with because it's professional it's stylish and uh, it, it, it loads very quick too so that's the 2014 theme anyway